Now this pond here has a auto top up on it. And that's a drain. So the water's going down the drain. And if the water's going down the drain, and there's an auto top up system on the pond, then that means that the auto system top up system is running. So what we've actually got to do is bend this cord with the float on it to make sure that that stops. And sometimes you can actually set them to make sure that um that the auto top up system stops running because if we keep pumping chlorinated water into this pond eventually will kill the fish now if you couldn't stop it for some unfortunate reason then you need to turn it off and then when the pond goes down you could literally turn it on for a while which would be unfortunate so with any of these situations it's good to look at the drain every now and then and just make sure that the drain's not running. And if the drain is running, you want an explanation for why the drain's running. Because having water constantly going into a pond like this will mean that you've um, got chlorine going in. And as far as chlorine going in is concerned, that's going to be relative to how much chlorine is in the town water at that particular time. Knowing that it's often dosed to a maximum minimum level which means sometimes it'll be okay, sometimes it won't be okay. And it'll also be relative to the amount of water that's running through it. If there's only a little bit of water running through it, 